Who is it, your dad? Yeah. Just wanting an update. Shame he's too busy buying cars. Huh. So no word from Andy then. Victoria's still trying. Still on the agricultural thing, she's left messages. Oh, is that it? Just a coffee. Uh, five of these cost me. I had to take a loan out for the fryer. You've had breakfast. Well, he's got to eat, Debs. More importantly, so have you. No. All right, and how long do you think you're going to last with no food inside you? Yes, all right. Once we get the results back. Well, you heard what they said. She's either anemic or she's got a little infection. And the blood transfusion or the antibiotics should sort her out, right? Just like that. No big deal, then. I didn't say that. I should never have left her. Yeah. Well, that time when her own collapsed, and where was I shopping? I took my eyes off her for ten minutes. You're too long, Cameron! I told you to keep a close eye on her, didn't I say that? You do know she dies. Debbie! It'll be my fault. Yeah, you said. Scared, all right, and she's under a lot of pressure. Yeah, tell me about it. Right, I'm going to the garage. She's better off without me. No, you're wrong. She needs you here. She doesn't want me anywhere near her. She's very sleepy, but you can still talk to her. Thank you. Hey, sweetheart. Mummy's here. What a little drama queen you're turning out to be, eh? I think she looks a little bit better, do you? Nice of Cameron to stick around. I guess his conscience couldn't hack it. You do realise this would have happened no matter who was with her? No one was with her. That's the point. Cameron was. All right, and he was on the phone for a few minutes. He was doing his best. He was rowing on the phone over money with his ex because of you, because he is desperate to support all of you right now. Call me old-fashioned, but I reckon that puts him way above most men in his position. What position's that? You're having a baby with your ex to save Sarah. And he's stuck by you through it all. Now, if that isn't a man who loves the bones off you, babe, I don't know what is. Chaz, Chaz, right, seriously, we still need to talk, darling. Things are going from bad to worse here. When you, when you get this message, give me a call back, please. How is she? Uh, yes, yeah, to be expected, really. She's having a transfusion. But is she going to be OK? Don't know. She's, I mean, she's stable. That's, that's about as much as we can hope for at the moment. Um, OK. Well, um, Andy's got the message. He's driving there now. Actually, why aren't you there? I'm just organising some stuff for Zach and Lisa. They're looking after the place for us. Well, I'll see you later then. OK. In fact, Victoria, hold up. Um, do you know what? You're right, I need to be there. So give us a couple of minutes and I'll, I'll run you down, OK? Hello. How is she? She's all right. They're just faffing with her and stuff, taking the blood pressure. Andy's on his way, but he says the traffic's horrendous. I brought Mr Chops. Thanks. Listen, I'm... I'm sorry. Let's go and grab a sandwich. Miss Dingle. We have some of Sam's test results back. Probably best if we speak in my office. Come with me. Listen, she'll be fine, all right? You don't think it's bad, do you? I don't know, Vic. Andy should be here. Hey, up. <laughs> Nearly scoffed a lot on the way here, yeah? but I held off. <laughs> How's she doing? They've got the results back. Come on. Come on. <sighs> now, she's one of us. She'll be tough as old boots. So what is it? As you know, Sarah's had the...
complete a transfusion, but her levels have been dropping quite considerably over the past few months. The increased bruising, the, the nosebleeds. Well, she's had her regular transfusions. Still. The latest blood count we've done has revealed quite a significant drop. Well, what does that mean? Is that why she collapsed? I'm so sorry. It, it's contributed, certainly, but we've also noted a change to her chromosome 7. And? Not only does she not produce enough blood cells, but the ones she does are abnormal and ineffective. So, it's happening. She's starting to get worse. I'm afraid she's starting to take the first steps towards developing leukemia. <clears throat> Sorry, um... How, how long before she gets it? Of that, we can't be certain. It could be anything from one to two years. Right now, we need to perform a bone marrow biopsy to establish how bad things are. She's ready for a transplant. She would need chemo before that, but yes. She will need a transplant soon. What's going on? What did he say? Yeah, I'll show you. Results back, and she's at the pre leukemic stage. Well, what's that? Um, um, she might not deteriorate for a long time yet. But she's much worse. But you're having the baby in a few weeks, that's good, isn't it? She's developing cancer now. Hey, Kai. Can't even go in there. She sees I'm a mess. Come here. Listen, it'll be okay. We'll get there, yeah? All of us together. Um, Andy's on his way. I didn't say much. That's all right. It's, you know, it's best that Debbie talks to him anyway. Yeah. There you are. Seriously, how long does it take to get her a drink? Yeah, sorry. It's just hot in there. I'll take it. I need to man up. How's she doing? Yeah, she's wondering where you are. I'm in Sarah. Just the same. Look, is everything all right, Cam? Yeah, it's fine. Apart from the obvious. You're still getting grief off your ex. Yeah, and the rest. I understand that she's gutted about losing the child support, but does she have any idea what we're up against right now? Well, give me the phone. Whoa, then. listen, I've got, I've got it. She needs to know. We are dealing with a really sick kid in there. Yeah, and like I say, I've got it, OK? I'm, I'm, I'm going to sort it. Well, good. I hope you are. Because Deb just does not need this, yeah? Zach's had to go back to the garage. Because Lisa's got Samson. Cheers. Come on, babe. Yeah, hey, now's not the time to fall to pieces. You know that, don't you? Look what I've just found. Oh, hallelujah. I got it as quick as I could. I'm sorry. I wish it. Well, tell me. We've had the results back. Dr. Harmer says she's getting worse. She's developing leukemia. What? Already? He also said that it could take a year, maybe two, for it to develop properly. They told us this would happen, but... Yeah, and it's happening now, Andy. But isn't the things they can do? We knew all this. Yeah, and knowing it and seeing it is not the same thing. Our little girl is getting weaker by the day. Dips. Yeah, listen, you've got to try and stay calm, babe. <laughs> Ow! I've just been told that our daughter has pretty much got cancer. Yeah, and you should be thinking about the baby. I am thinking about the baby, Mum. It's only three weeks until your due date. She can't be dealing with this stress. No. And neither can Sarah. 
What do you mean? I want to be induced. I'm having this baby today. 